formed image consulting groups. A woman that is proud to be of color and over 40. So today I am doing an eyebrow tutorial. And as you can very well see, I've already done one, but I want to do the other one with you. So you're going to need a few tools and a few products. So I'm going to go ahead and tell you what they are, what I have used, and then you can just make, do, use something comparable. Or if you can find it at your local store, please do so. Okay, so the first thing that we will need is a light brown pencil liner. Light brown pencil liner. Okay, so let me do this so that you can see that as good as you can see it. A light brown pencil liner. Okay, take the lid off. See that that light, I mean super light, okay? It's pretty much for like a, a person with blonde hair. Okay, then the next thing you're going to need is, this is um, right from the Oriental store, um, and it's called Sunny Waterproof uh, Liner, Eyeliner, and it is in a deeper shade of brown. It's like a reddish brown, and that is it. Okay, and just so you see the tip, that's what the tip looks like, and it's a roll-up pencil. Okay, the next thing you will need is a brown eye shadow. Okay, this is, I hate to show it like that, but it's quite used. Um, it's MAC, and it is um, corduroy. The next thing you will need is some water in a small container as such. I carry this with me in my kit so and you will need some concealer a little lighter than your own skin um, a couple of shades lighter maybe this one for my complexion which you can see I'm kind of a dark brown um, kind of red toned woman um, this one is NC 42 by MAC so you can go pick a shade up like that or either go stand at a mat counter mat, um, get some in a container if your budget is low, and um, get some in the container. They always give samples, and um, take it to a Wally World or uh, um, Target, which is Walmart or Target, and get the color you need in the cheaper one. And the next thing that you will need is a flat hair brush. Okay and um, so it looks like that is flat straight across the top because you need precision and you're also going to need an angled brush as well okay so those are the tools you need um, you can stop the video gather your tools and then let's get to work okay so um, I am going to go ahead and get started with the lighter brown the lightest brown um, pencil and what I'm going to do is I'm going to line where how I want this brow to be which I really 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 wanted to match the other side and as you can see you can just barely see that a liner and that is on purpose for me. I just want to be able to create the line. Okay. So I don't know if you guys can see that. You shouldn't probably be able to see it too, too good. But now we're going to go with our dark, darker brown liner. And we're going to just trace over what we initially done. Okay. So hopefully you guys can see what I'm doing really, really well. And as you can see, 
the center part of that I'm leaving open okay I'm leaving that open so I created two lines right one down here and one up above it a little bit then I left the center open now that is where our brown shadow and our first flat brush is going to come into place this one okay in the water you're going to dampen this a little but not soak it okay so if you get it a little bit too wet if you get a little bit too wet I keep a little towelette right with me I, I do it standardly anyway the little towelette I keep it with me to kind of wipe my brushes off a little bit and so you're gonna go ahead and um, rub some of the moisture off and rub it across your brown eyeshadow and then right in the center where we've left that open you're gonna go ahead and fill that in with the brown shadow and again that the one that I'm using is um, MAC and it is the corduroy you're welcome to use something darker if you would like if it's going to match your skin tone better you can go ahead and use it so now your brows need to be um, highlight just like when you contour and highlight your face same thing for your brows so now to give that beautiful highlighted look um, that's where the concealer is going to come in you just take a little dab and put it on the back of your hand and again with your flat brush you're going to pick up some concealer and you're just going to go one straight line without lifting the brush and that will take a little bit of practice but you'll get it and then just sweep downward so that you can take that excess product away from the brow you're not taking it off you're just um, you're just uh, what am I trying to say blending it out you got it I knew I knew you know what I was talking about okay and then you're gonna go to the top of the brow sorry for my hand being in the way and you're just gonna sweep across that top again two and then you're gonna blend that out again sorry for my hand being in the way blend that upward away from your darker color and then just in here just a touch you don't need to put any more product on your brush just inside now here's where the angle brush comes in at the angle brush is not going to do that much work you're just going to dip it on your powder eyeshadow but don't don't dip the, the angle one in the water this time just let the powder be dry and just make some light strokes just like that and there you have it the perfect brows I hope this has helped you guys um, do subscribe to my channel do keep in touch um, every all the information will be in the sidebar over there that I used um, and ways to contact me as well but do subscribe to my page thank you so much and you have a great day bye